In sports news now, Mohamed Salah scored twice as Liverpool comfortably beat old rivals Manchester United 4-0 at the Anfield on Tuesday to move top of the Premier League for 24 hours at least. The Liverpool moved to 76 points from 32 games with title rivals Manchester City on 74 points from one game fewer with Pep Guardiola's side hosting Brighton and Hove Albion at the Etihad today. Now, Colombian Luis Diaz gave Liverpool a fifth-minute lead, tapping in from close range after Sadio Mane set Mohamed Salah free down the right and the Egyptian delivered a pinpoint low cross for a simple finish. I'm pretty sure I will ask anyway about it. Uh, my, my, my moment of the game, even when it was very important and a great result, was the seventh minute when our people showed pure class and um, the whole stadium together. Um, showed pure class uh, in a moment where we obviously everybody knew since yesterday, since I heard first time about it, uh, um, so many things that are much more important in life than, than football. And obviously we, we really feel for, for Cristiano and his family. Um, so that was my moment of the game, but um, other football moments um, were obviously absolutely outstanding. Yes, Mo scored two, set up the first. Luis set up Sadio's um, and get uh, the ball from Mo and all this kind of... Thiago came on, set Mo's second up, all these kind of things who couldn't have been better, to be honest. I don't, I don't think so, to be honest, no. I don't think that they have mentally checked out. It's just a different level. They, they have better players than we have, if you look at it in total. And... Um, and this is what what reflected was was reflected by the results today. So uh, there will be a rebuild for sure, but right now that doesn't help us because we still have another five games to play. So that there has to be a rebuild for me was clear even when I came in in December and after the first three or four weeks for me that was obvious. But uh, right now it doesn't help, and for us it's extremely um, embarrassing also as a coaching staff to have press conference with conferences like the one we have right now. But we just have to admit they are better than us. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.